Hi everyone, welcome back to Diamond Paints with Mike. I'm super, super excited to show you this unboxing. Oh my god, um, rollers fell on the floor there, apologies. Uh, <laughs> that's how excited I am to show you this unboxing. Like, I'm, I, I cannot, like, I'm super excited. Right, so I've been in the range and I have got, as you can see, another bag. Um, but we have got some other exciting bits and bobs in here. And this time I went for... It's the little Aberdeen Angus. Yes, I think they call this an Aberdeen Angus or a Highland cow. Um, because Aberdeen Anguses normally are brown and they have quite long fur. And you normally find them in Scotland. And hence why they're called Aberdeen Angus. Um, but this is, as you can see, a bag as well. What's quite nice is they've only put... They've, all the glue is on the bit that's in... The, mid, the focus point in this so it's really really lovely i'm gonna say that she's a girl cow gown um because obviously she's got flowers in her hair but this is one of them other tote bags these bags retail at 3.99 and you get the highland cow it's from that fabulous company called art studio it seems to be like a new company out here um and this is absolutely gorgeous highland cow diamond painting cut, uh, bag there and as you can see you've got the jewels in here and again that beautiful beautiful neon tray absolutely gorgeous so let's take that off and see what we've got inside super exciting isn't it oh wow so let's take a look inside here so again You've got yourself your, I'm not going to get all that out because we've shown you that already on the uh, line bag that you saw. But as you can see, you've got your neon uh, pink bag there with your tweezers. And um, I think that's fabulous how they've chucked all that in. Because as you know, with some of the Timu ones and Amazon, you won't catch yourself getting tweezers in there unless you're very lucky. So I'll pop them back in there. And these are the jewels that we've got. So we've got ourselves a black, a brown a darker brown, um, a grey, and we've got a peachy colour, and we've got a sort of orangey coffee colour, and another sort of orangey colour, cream, peachy colour, I suppose, um, what I like to call gorilla shit. Um, <laughs> and then we got um, a peach, a green, a pink, a lime green, and a brown, and a beautiful red, which probably is the 666. Now, I've not noticed any um, schematic charts in this, so you'll have to be careful with this one. So what we'll do is we'll pop that back into there for safekeeping, because if I don't put it back in here, I won't know what paint ins to what bag. So normally you get a little sheet, um, but in this case we haven't got that. So I'm just gonna make a terrible job of this. No, it's ripped. <laughs> Right, I'll tell you what, what I'll do then is I'll open the um, tote bag and I'll just place the bit jewels in there and then that way I know them for that bag. But as you can see, isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely. What's, why does it look so clumped? Is there something in there? But absolutely gorgeous. What I will say is, is if you're getting these bags, what you could do is do that as a Christmas present, but put like... Um, there's two things you could uh, you know wrap that up as a present then put another present inside it so the person gets to unwrap it or you could diamond paint it yourself give it to them and then their presents in that bag but I just had to get that which is the Highland Cow I am finding that I'm collecting all the bags I'm not really a tote bag person but you never know um, when you need a tote bag um, <laughs> so let's put that to one side and then I could not resist guys I had to get another one <laughs> So I had to get this. Now, that looks like the deluxe dog off of, is it called Shaggy? There's a film with Tim Allen and there's a dog that looks like this and he turns into a dog. So he keeps, like, one minute he's a dog and then he's a human. Then he goes back to a dog and he's Tim Allen is actually the dog. I don't know what it's called, but what I love about this is I think you've got eyes here because so you've got the white drills, as you can see beautiful stick there but this is absolutely light i'm telling you now if you've not been shopping at the range seriously the amount of new stuff coming out at the moment and again inside here 3.99 again and um looks like they sell it in euros as well so 5.20 if you're abroad so let's get into this and see what we got so oh, 
So let's take a look at our wheels. So in here, we have, look at that. That looks a little bit lighter, doesn't it, that tray? Hmm. That's not as funky as the bigger one. Hmm. That's interesting, because I've uh, pinched one of them for my... Yeah, that's a totally different pink look. Um, okay, that's a little bit disappointing, but it's nice to have a different shade of the pink. Let's take a look in here. We have ourselves a beautiful baby pink. We've got a burgundy colour, and we've got a pink, and we've got a brown, and another brown, a darker brown, another black, I think that is. Oh, yeah, black. And then we've got a, a brown, and a sort of sandy, browny, vanilla sort of colour there. A couple of... Uh, creams or coffees and then a beautiful very vibrant white so this is one of the other bags i have now got my eye on the cat there is a cat bag as well so i'm probably going to go and get that um <laughs> there's so many bags but i think i've got the whole collection now because uh i've um sorry i've just spilled a few jewels there i think i've probably got the whole collection now because um i'm running out of ones to buy now so um, yeah, is I think this is uh, trouble is with these bags is that they're on the shelf. You've got loads of people touching them, so I have just noticed a little mark there. So I might have to get a dish cross on that or something to sort that out. But as you can see, absolutely, oh, it's gorgeous, isn't it? Now, the next thing is really, really interesting because I found this, and this is from Art Studio. And apparently, it's the Underwater Crystal Canvas Set of Two. These retail at $8.99, or if you're aboard, it's €11.70. But you do get yourself two fabulous paintings in this. You've got yourself the seahorse, and you've also got yourself this beautiful little turtle here. Absolutely gorgeous. And as you can see down there, it just shows you what you get. So you get two stretch canvas. They're both 30 times 30 Two wax squares, two diamond paint styluses, two gem bases, 30 four colour gem bags and two wall hanging kits so yeah a lot of these art studio ones do come with the backing so let's get into this and there's just a sort of colour palette for you um you do also get your little wall hanging um <coughs> brackets there they just screw into the back um normally on the top bit um on the back of the wood so that you guys can hang them up and when i saw this i just was like oh my god that is so got to work with my ocean bathroom because i'm turning my bathroom into like an ocean like <laughs> sort of <laughs> like an ocean sort of vibe so i want to have like different canvases on the wall to replicate the ocean um so let's take a look inside here and see so i've got some jewels stuck on this let's see Oh, let's see what we got in here. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Got loads of bags. So we'll put one to one side. I don't know what one we've got first, but we have, as you can see, the jewels in here. So I will um, take that out in a minute. And as you can see in here, oh, wow. Oh, oh, isn't that gorgeous? Oh, wow. That's a lot of blue, isn't it? And I like the sort of like flick of the towel here. Seahorses are magical, magical creatures because I think it's the male that carries the babies. So when the female, um, I think the female passes them to the male and then the male sort of hatches them. Um, but they tend to spend, so I hear, they spend most of their life tied to the seabed. So this is absolutely fantastic it is so nice i don't want to take it out the film yet so i'm just going to leave that there i'm really sorry but i just don't want to take it out the film it's that beautiful um but you can see you've got some greens and blues in there absolutely gorgeous isn't it really really beautiful one i i just can't take that out at the moment that is absolutely stunning oh so blue isn't it you got a little starfish. This is a little, little fishy. Oh, yes. Oh, this is a beautiful one. Very, very gorgeous. Yeah, I, I can't take that out of the packaging. That's going to have to stay in that for now. Um, it's not very often I do that, but I just feel if I was to take that out at the moment, it would just, like, get dust on it. So, yeah. Um, we'll see what the other one's like. We might be able to take that out, but... I'm going to pop that back in the box for now, but let's take a look at another one, guys. And this is 
So this one, we'll see what that one looks and see if we can take that out. And oh, right. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> it's a little bit lighter. Um, wow. Okay. So we've got a fishy. Um, this is the turtle swimming down. And we also have this giant starfish. Now, a lot of the creators on here that Diamond Paint do love their turtles. We've got Debbie over at um, Diamond Paint Cajun. We also have Sarah over at, I can't remember her channel name. Um, Cross for Sarah, is it? I don't know, but I'll link it in the description. Um, do check out their channels. They're really, really good. Um, but yeah, they do love their turtles and so do I. So um, yeah, that is gorgeous. And we've got the seaweed coming in. Do you know what? This is a better one. So I'm not saying the seahorse isn't, but the way the seahorse is, it's so beautifully done. I don't want to like get it out until I'm really going to get ready into doing it. I'm probably going to start it next week. Um, but let me get into, I need to get something, um, my craft knife here, but... No, that's not it. Where have I put the craft knife? Oh, Gordon Bennett. Um, <laughs> okay, uh, we'll have to go to plan B and just poke it with a pen. Um, <laughs> yeah, this one I've got to try and see what they look like in here. Look at that. Fantastic. And we got a shed load of bags. I've had so many bags at the moment um, with all the kits that they come in. But let's take a look at this. Oh. This looks, this looks absolutely stunning. Oh, wow. Look at that. Let's just take that cellophane off a minute. So, oh, it's actually, they've actually put some excess here. It seems to be wrapped around it, around the side here. Oh, my. Wow, they've, uh, that's really not a good idea because, as you can see, it splits. I don't know why they've done that because this side hasn't got got that on but oh yeah that's more than enough stick yeah that's i think they've not cut that properly because this side doesn't have that and then this side's got all this excess on it i don't like the idea of that so okay interesting um but these are the drills in here looks absolutely gorgeous doesn't it oh wow 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 look at that so in here we have We've got ourselves a red one, a blue, classic Union Jack colours there, and a lighter blue, lots of different blues in this. We've got a minty green, I, like, I do like that colour, it's a nice pastel vibe there. We've got a sort of um, sandy brown there, a couple of uh, lighter brownie chocolatey colours, and we've got a blue, oh, some lovely banana colours there. It reminds me, my dad always used to have a shirt like that, very similar to that colour. Um, and it was always reminding me of bananas, you know. And then we've got blues and a, a sort of orangey colour, a, a white, a green and a purple. So absolutely fabulous. So let's put that to one side. And now for the best bit of all. You know, I've been banging on about that bloody cupcake. Well, I couldn't believe it. I went in there and look, I've got it. Oh, I'm so happy. Like last time I went there, it was on the discount rack. Um, discount rack and i was i didn't have enough room in my bag and as a general rule i don't carry bags if my bag's at full capacity it waits till next time because i i do not see the point in carrying bags when i've got a rucksack so i was just hoping and praying i don't think this is selling very well at the range because this was on the back wall where all the other ones were and then the last sort of month or so they've put it on the discount rack uh, which is basically like a clearance rack. So whether it's not selling very well, I don't know. But it looks like they're trying to shift it. I only literally paid three quid for this. So let's get into this because I am like just buzzing to get into this. It's a 30 times 30 and it just suits me well, doesn't it? You know, I love cakes. I love donuts. So <laughs> I just had to get it. So just going to get... <sighs> okay. Into this. Oh! <gasps> What the hell? Oh, wow. We've got a bloody love heart. What the hell? Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. <laughs> I've never had love hearts before. Look at this. Wow. Oh, my God. So, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven love hearts. That is a love heart. No way. I've never seen a painting with a love heart before. I mean, I know we got them. What was them other ones? Little roses. But love hearts? Oh, my God. 
Oh, wow. Ju I mean, just look at the colour palette on this. This is going to be superb, isn't it? Oh, man. I've got to get into this. I cannot tell you <laughs> how happy I am to finally get this. Because this is one that I really, really wanted. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Right, I'll tell you something, yeah. That is... I can't believe this. We've got love hearts in this. Right. OMG. I wonder what it's going to look like. Hopefully it's not too pink. Because you don't want it looking like all one thing. But let's take a look and... Oh, bloody hell, yes, it is uh, <laughs> rather on the pink side. Um, but, wow. So, in this, this has got lots of colour going on. These little love hearts that we've got here, you see the hearts, they're all going to go round the side. So, I think they're supposed to replicate, like, hundreds and thousands. But this is absolutely gorgeous. Look at all this lovely whipped cream here, all the icing, them sort of things. Remember in cereals, you used to get these chocolate straws and you would suck the milk up and then eat the straw? That's what they remind me of. And then this beautiful donut that reminds me of Bart Simpson, uh, sorry, Homer Simpson in The Simpsons. This is beautiful. And to finish it off, look at that. The detail that's gone into this is fantastic. That is absolutely, oh man, I'm happy with that. That's gorgeous. All oh, this lovely pink as well. It's so nice to have a different background than your standard white all the time. But, oh man, if you've not got this, guys, seriously, you need to get this cupcake. It's gorgeous. So let's take a look at the um, thing that we've got here. And this tape has got stuck to it. But as you can see, we have this lovely bit here as you can see, which looks really, really cool. And then what we've got also is our drills, which I'm super excited to see about. This is the thing, guys, at the range, you just can't stop buying. It used to be Timu the favorite, but I think I'm slowly, you know, my favorite is the range. Um, so we've got a lovely schematic here, as you can see, really, really lovely. And these, I'm super excited to see what them jewels look like. We've got a pink and a violet there. And look, these are the little drills. Oh, look at these. Little love hearts. See, again, you could use them for embellishments or embossing on cards if you make cards. Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Very, very beautiful. If we've got any spare, which I don't think we will have of that, we will keep them for something for Valentine's Day, maybe. Because they're always good to put on, you know, gifts or making things. And uh, we've got a purple one up band there. This one's beautiful. Let's get at that. Do you remember the jelly little sweets that you could get with Haribo? I think it was Haribo, but they used to do white and pink heart sweets. That's what they remind me of. And then you've got this lovely silvery one here. Oh, I can't. I've got to get started on this. White, and we've got an orange, and we've got a sort of bluey colour, a light blue, a pink. Very sort of, again, them lovely lighter pastel colours here. Blue, pink, and a sort of coffee vanilla sort of colour. A yellow, um, uh, orangey sort of colour, and uh, three sets of different pink. But I'll tell you something, guys. This has been a really, really good visit to the range because, uh, yeah... I, I can't get over that. For, you know, my sister's moving house. So I think this, I mean, you know, if I could, I, I really want to keep it myself um, because I just love cakes. And it will, if I put that on the wall, it just reminds me to buy more cakes. Um, <laughs> but I would like to do this for my sister as like a welcoming present. Whether she, she would accept it, I don't know, because she's not really into frames and that. But, you know. It, it would make a nice home gift, but oh man, seriously, I, I love my bags, but I, I, I really like this. So, yeah, absolutely gorgeous. So let us know what your favourite is, guys. Is it your seahorse? Um, I put it back in the box now, but um, we also have the turtle here. We've got this beautiful little doggy bag. And as I said, they've got a cat and they've also got fruit ones. So you've got like lemons on a tree um uh, like strawberries as well so i might go for the fruit bags as well we've also got ourselves the highland cow as well and as i said if i just get it out of the box it is this beautiful beautiful seahorse so yeah if you've not shopped with the range guys 
do shop with a range. I'll put all the links in the description of this video. The bags are available online as well, but your best option is to try and get them from the store because you get it the same day and you know, you're, you know you don't have to wait for delivery. But yeah, absolutely over the moon with this. Um, super happy about the cake. Thank you for watching. Take care. We'll see you next week for another, possibly the range. <laughs> Take care, guys. Bye-bye.